If there's any city desperate to come out of lockdown, it's Leicester. It was the first to be placed under local restrictions last summer and they were never really lifted. We're told that this is the way out. Nice and relaxed, shout scratch going in. 15 million people have now had their first dose. But a new study in Leicester could have major implications for the rollout. Researchers have found that black and Asian NHS workers, those most at risk from the disease, aren't coming forward for their vaccine compared to their white colleagues. In a study of 19,000 workers, researchers found that only 37% of black NHS staff had had the vaccine and only 59% of South Asian staff. This compares to 71% of white workers. Age seems to be a significant factor. Of those who were unvaccinated, nearly a third were under the age of 30. Mubarak Yusuf is 20 and a pharmaceutical student. He tells me he's one of those who won't be having the vaccine. I'm young for stars and most people my age, like they would recover within usually like a week. There are some people who are young and who have ended up in hospital. Does that not worry you? I haven't really got any like health conditions or anything like that. And um, like my mum, she's already taken the vaccine. So I feel like I don't need, I don't need to worry about that part of my life. The study hasn't yet been peer reviewed, but what's interesting is that researchers looked at occupation as well as ethnicity. They found that take up of the vaccine was highest at 73% amongst those in administrative or executive roles. But what's potentially worrying is that it was lowest at 53% amongst doctors. It's one thing having scepticism amongst the general population, but what's shocking about your research is that it was amongst healthcare workers. Absolutely. We were expecting some form of hesitancy, but not to the extent we've seen. Professor Kamlesh Kunthi was one of the lead researchers at the University of Leicester NHS Trust, which employs one of the most diverse healthcare workforces in the country. Should we now look at making the vaccine compulsory for healthcare workers? This is a, a time for uh, engagement. Uh, this is a time for messaging the messenger. But if after all this time, healthcare workers still aren't getting the message, given their role, should it be compulsory? This this isn't a, a huge ethical uh, dilemma. I'm not an expert on ethics, but this is something that the National Health Service will need to discuss. We've suffered in unimaginable ways. This is part of that messaging, a video aimed at tackling hesitancy amongst black and Asian communities. There is no chip or tracker in the vaccine to keep watching where you go. Your mobile phone actually does a much better job of that. The reasons for that hesitancy are of course varied and complex, including long-standing discrimination, misinformation and low levels of trust. Other NHS trusts, including in London, have seen similar patterns amongst some ethnic groups. Leicester Hospitals Trust told us that they want everyone to get the jab when they're called and that since the study, three in four staff have been vaccinated. Darshna Sonny, Channel 4 News, Leicester.